Hey, it's Sasha Evdikov and thanks for joining me this week. Now, this week I have something a little bit different, something a little bit more special uh, than what I normally post. And that is because this week we're gonna be talking about your own trading computer or your own trading workstation. Now, uh, this computer right here is actually the one that I use. I've put it together uh, just this last week. And uh, really putting together computer pieces is just something that I enjoy. It's one of those hobbies I like to do. Uh, not to mention, if something does go wrong, I'm able to quickly diagnose the issue and just uh, you know fix it and take care of the problem most of the time. Now, I will admit I'm not a huge expert on building computers. It's not my forte and it's not my specialty but I will give you some insight to what some of the mentors uh, taught me about building the computer for my needs, uh, you know, because I actually have to have someone, you know, show me step by step because I didn't want to mess it up. So they actually came over and showed me how to put together all the puzzle pieces. And that's how I learned a lot about uh, putting together these things. And uh, even now I still have uh, that one person consulting with them about what it is I should get for my uh, computer needs and for my setup. So with this in mind, I wanna share with you some of the parts, some of the pieces uh, that you should look for, whether you decide to A, build your own trading workstation, or B, whether you're looking to purchase a computer for your trading needs, what are some of the things that you should look for? So we'll talk about kind of three main things. We'll talk about a basic computer. We'll talk a little bit more about the intermediate computer and maybe more of the advanced level computer. And I'll also share with you the exact parts that I've purchased for my computer as of uh, June 2015. Now things do change in the technology world very quickly. So typically I will do the upgrades for the computer uh, probably within every single year or every single year and a half because I want to make sure I'm running on a consistent and smooth system. Uh, if you try to just keep up with the computer and all the technology stuff all the time, uh, it's just very difficult because they're constantly evolving, they're constantly changing and constantly just getting better. So uh, in reality, you don't need a major powerful computer in order to be a profitable trader. In fact, you could just use a simple cell phone uh, or any device that's connected to the internet to make great trades. However, if you want something a little bit more powerful, if you're a little more serious about it, uh, you know, you need to have the right and appropriate tools. So in this week's video, what I want to share with you is all the parts that I put inside my trading computer and trading workstation uh, that are really more critical. I'm not going to share with you exactly how to put the puzzle pieces or the components together in the computer, even though it's something that I personally enjoy doing. It's a fun thing and I don't think it's too difficult. It'll take you a few hours to do, uh, but it'll give you some insight as far as parts go how to choose the right parts, how to look for these specific components uh, when looking for your specific trading needs. So that's what it, really what I wanna share with you is go in detail about all the different parts, all the different uh, components, what to look for uh, if you're looking for a basic computer, if you're looking for a medium trading computer or maybe something a little bit more powerful. So it'll give you some insight, it'll give you some uh, awareness to your own trading workstation and that way if you decide to build your own, then you can go ahead and research how to do that. Or if you decide to go ahead and just purchase your own pre-made computer, uh, you know, you can go ahead and at least have an idea of what you're looking for. Now this video lesson is quite lengthy and I like to think of it as more of a mini course. So uh, if you're interested in getting this video lesson, it's actually absolutely free. It's available online. All you have to do is go ahead and click this link right here. And when you get there, just enter your name and email address and you'll get that free mini lesson about the trading computer. And that's where I'm gonna go in detail about all the different parts, uh, looking at the screen, choosing your parts, what to look for, uh, as I was taught from some of my uh, mentors that taught me how to build uh, you know, my computers and who still advise me. So I'm gonna give you some of their insight as well uh, based on what they told me. So uh, go ahead, click this link. When you get there, enter your name and email address and you know, you'll get that video absolutely free uh, right in your email box. So I look forward to seeing you on the other side. Just make sure you set a little bit time in order to view the video and study the material because it is a little bit lengthy, almost like a mini little course.